Hey everyone. I'm, in this video, I'm going to show you how to install IMBU on macOS. Um, this version is going to be useful for Ventura, Sonoma, and the latest, Sequoia. I'm using Vistar, but this is because this is the only uh, Mac that I have available, but will work on the others. This guide is for M1, M2, and Intel Macs. So I'll walk you through every steps. Uh, we are going to use Wineskin and Homebrew. So let's get started. First, we are going to go to the official IMU download page. And then we're going to go to your profile. Click on Download Desktop App. Scroll down on the release notes. And at the very bottom, you will see the Windows installer. Make sure that it's the latest. This one is going to be the 30 of April or 2025. Now let's install Homebrew, which is a package manager that we'll use to install a few tools that we need. First, you're going to go and open your terminal. And paste this command uh, that is going to be in the description. This is the installer. Uh, it's going to download automatically from the web. So it's going to ask you to put your password, type it in, hit, hit enter. For the third step, we're going to use Wineskin. That is, if you have seen my later in my latest tutorial, we use Wineskin on an older version to install IMBU. So uh, in this case, we are going to the GitHub um, Wineskin Calworks. Uh, we are going to copy these, um, this command and also use the terminal where we are going to install it. So copy that, copy that command, we're going to paste it, and we are going to run it. Uh, once you have installed Wineskin Winery, open it and follow these steps. First, we're going to add the engine. Click this one, that is the latest. Click on the on the update if you need it. And now that we have skin uh, wine skin set up, it's time to create the IMU wrapper. You're going to go ahead and create a new wrapper. This is going to be our virtual Windows environment for IMU. So just a quick message while we wait. While the wrapper is being created, I just wanted to say that if you find this video helpful and want to see more content like this, you can support my Patreon. I've been doing Blender and IMU tutorials for over four years and haven't monetized my channel yet, so your support really helps. In this Patreon, you will also get exclusive lessons, my private Discord server. You can ask me directly if you want uh, if you have any issues with this, you'll find all the links in the descriptions and it takes a lot. Now let's get going.
Okay, now that our wrapper is ready, we're going to click install software. Um, we're going to choose the IMU installer exe file that we downloaded earlier. Just don't leave yet, uh, since we need to do a few adjustments before uh, running IMU directly. Uh, this is because we don't have an uh, icon that we can actually click and run the, the application. If not, you are going to install every time, every single time that you open the wine, wine screen. And right now, when we are asked to choose an uh, executable, we're going to select IMU quality, quality agent.exe. That's the one that launches the app properly. Okay, so once installed, you can launch uh, IMU directly. Um, we can also uh, use the icon if you want. From your Mac, using Wineskin Wrapper, uh, it's really easy. You just need to type IBU and will appear with this icon. If everything went smoothly, you should now be able to log in and use the client normally. It's a good idea to test it by closing and reopening it uh, to make sure it saved the path correctly. So now, congratulations! You have uh, you have now IMU running on Mac OS. Whether it's Pixar, Ventura, Sonoma, or Sequoia, if this tutorial helped you, please subscribe to my channel and leave a like. Leave a comment if you like. Um, let me know if this works for you or if you encountered any issues. So you can find me on Patreon uh, for tutorials. Join Discord. If you want any questions, if you have any questions, you can reach me, right? Uh, my links are on the description. And thank all for watching. Take care, guys. Bye.